Leaders of the Social Democratic Party have converged on the ancient city of Ibadan in Oyo State where they identify the party as the most credible and best prepared to rescue, the Nige to rescue Nigeria from its present socio-economic woes. This standpoint formed the basis of a Southwest Summit for stakeholders where attendees at the event stressed that the forthcoming general elections offered Nigerians, Nigerians a unique opportunity to rewrite history and free themselves from what the term shackles of poverty, neglect, and bad governance. In his speech, presidential candidate of the SDP, Adewoli Adebayo, urged Nigerians to queue up behind candidates that can impact their lives positively and turn around the fortune of the citizenry for good. So an election in which our people should be trading in ideas, trading in competing technologies and methodologies for the future. You, are, you use your poor decision and injustice to force them to be interrogating religion. So there is no church you go to today that they don't ask God, God, have you abandoned us? Are we so incompetent that we cannot be part of leadership in this country? But that issue will not have arisen, if not because of that injustice done. And if you say, well, it doesn't matter, Every accumulation of injustice normalizes injustice. And a society that normalizes injustice will never know peace. That is why in Nigeria, the greatest prayer, the most common prayer is just is peace. We want peace in the land. But peace doesn't come by prayer. Peace comes by doing justice. And you can't do justice without starting with saying the truth. Education should not be a debate. At this point in our history, we should not be discussing whether teachers should go to work or not. We should be interrogating the content of our curriculum, whether it's, it's catching on, whether it has any cutting edge, whether our mathematics should be more advanced than Singaporean mathematics, whether quantum physics should be brought to the level of senior secondary school, or we should be teaching it in early university education. Those are the things we should be talking about now. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.